85 year old Chuck Hunter, it's just another day on the dairy farm. Open since 1927, the farm has been passed down six generations, but he fears that will soon come to an end. A few generations or several generations down the road, there isn't going to be any farmland, any place. To help preserve this lush green space, 20 counties in the state have created farm protection boards. Mon County is one of three in the program without funding, but Commissioner Ed Hawkins is pushing to make it active. The commission is permitted to put a tax on property transfer. Now there's already one stamp that you have that goes one to the state and one that is kept in the general fund. The voluntary program allows farmers to donate or sell an easement for their property to the board. Once that easement is in place, the future of the farm is protected. But many farmers like Chuck worry about big business. According to American Farmland Trust, two acres of farmland is lost every minute in America due to development. But it's that development that keeps the county thriving. Commissioner Tom Bloom is concerned that farm preservation could put a burden on taxpayers. There's not that interest or need here. So that, that's why I have a question why we would even go through this, collect this money, and then put it aside and just always leave it there because it would be, it'd be untouchable. I'll run it as far as I can and as long as I can and then turn it over to the next generation and see what happens. While no decision has been made, Chuck says he's determined to keep his property from getting plowed over.